President Biden signing the American Rescue Plan into law this afternoon, a day earlier than expected. The massive $1.9 trillion COVID-19 relief bill approved by the House in a near party line vote. The bill provides checks of $1,400 to most Americans. It also extends, ex, uh, extends uh, expanded unemployment benefits through September. The president also set to speak to the nation tonight at 7, and you can watch that address right here on Fox 6. Those stimulus checks will soon be on the way to many of you. The White House press secretary saying that people could actually start seeing direct deposits as early as this weekend. As Jason Calvi shows us, it's just one chunk of a much larger bill. The thickness of a dollar is a fraction of an inch. One million dollars stacked up would reach the top of Milwaukee City Hall. One billion dollars is 67 miles. So from here in Milwaukee, all the way to Fond du Lac. And $1.9 trillion would reach from here halfway to the moon. Part of that, $1,400 per dependent child. Now, people making less than $75,000 will get $1,400 checks. Couples making less than $150,000, you'll get $2,800. Save it again, you know, build up my emergency fund, or, you know, a lot of people are, you know, deciding to throw it into the stock market right now. The bill leads tax preparers to scramble. Several hundred clients we've identified as we're going to have to contact them. One reason the new law retroactively applies to many people who last year claimed unemployment. When your income was under 150000 you can exclude up to $10,200 of that unemployment income from being taxed, uh, which is a huge benefit because that much less income, you're going to end up with more money back in your pocket. Here at Buck Bradley Saloon, they're hopeful about people having that extra money. More money in people's pockets, they're more likely to come on out. And that definitely ends up helping all these businesses. And when I do end up getting reopened, it'll definitely help me. Republicans say the plan is untargeted to those truly in need, wasteful, and includes a liberal wish list. In Milwaukee, Jason Calvi, Fox 6 News. The IRS will use your most recent federal tax filing to determine both your eligibility and the amount you may receive. So if you haven't filed yet and you won't get to it and say the next day, they'll look at your 2019 filing. If they have your bank info, they will send the money electronically or otherwise they will send paper checks or even a debit card.